Are Christians hypocrites if they get involved in politics? Hi, I'm Ken Yates from Grace Evangelical Society, and I'd like to try to answer that question. It's a very difficult question. And the reason I bring it up is because it comes up every now and then in our conferences, in our Sunday school classes. Just recently, I was discussing with some believers, and this was one of the issues that came up. Because basically, as free grace people, most of us are what is called dispensationalists, and we believe that the kingdom of God is in the future, and we're looking for the coming kingdom. And we believe that this world is getting worse and worse in other theological systems, such as post-millennialism, the world is getting better and better and better. And the church has a responsibility to try to reform society to prepare uh, the coming of the Lord. But as premillennialists and as dispensationalists, what we say is, no, 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 the, the world is going to get worse and worse and worse and worse. And the only hope we have is the coming of the Lord. And he's going to establish a righteous kingdom. So that leads to the question. And it's a great question. If I believe that, if I believe that this world is going to get worse and worse and worse and worse, and there's nothing that we can do about it, should we as believers try to change our culture? Should we in the United States get involved in politics and try to make this into a Christian nation? Let me just say right off the bat that I think that Christians are going to differ on this question. But I do think that if we say that we believe in a coming kingdom and that this world is going to get worse and worse, if premillennialism is correct, which I believe it is, then I think we have to go into it saying, okay, we are not going to change this world. Whatever involvement we have in the political system, we are not going to change <laughs> this into a Christian nation. But is it wrong to then say, okay, then the Christian should be should not be involved in politics whatsoever? The way this question is is often asked is, is it wrong, for example, for a Christian to run for political office? I remember uh, some years ago reading a a book by an old Plymouth Brethren writer, and that was his position. <laughs> For example, he said, uh, uh, do not judge in the Sermon on the Mount means that the Christian should never be a judge at the local level or at the federal level or whatever the case may be. And I don't think the Lord was saying that at all. Uh, my personal opinion is that it is not sinful and it is not hypocritical to be involved in political issues, uh, at, uh, for example, at the local level, at a local church, if uh, they're having uh, drag queen story hours at, at your kid's school, uh, and you say, no, I, I don't want my kid exposed to that. My personal opinion is that in Romans 1, Paul talks about the wrath of God. And the wrath of God is something that we can experience here and now. And Paul lists a number of things that result in the wrath of God, sinful activity. And if I live in a community where I say, I'm waiting for the coming kingdom, I'm, I'm waiting for the coming king, I know that I'm not going to transform this uh, culture or this society into a, a, a Christian one, but I can still, if certain policies are adopted, uh, avoid the negative consequences of those policies. Uh, if I'm one who is uh, fighting for what I believe are biblical values, that here and now I am going to, and my family is going to, and my, and my church is going to benefit from those policies. And I don't see anything wrong with saying I'm going to promote them. 
whether it's again the uh, stopping drag queen uh, story hour or uh, sexual expressions with kids in our school system, for example, certain books. It's not good for anybody there, and that's going to have a negative impact upon my community. Are you a hypocrite? If you're a Christian and you get involved in political issues, there's going to be differences of opinion, and there's going to be differences uh, in how individual believers uh, respond to particular situations. I believe we have the freedom to use wisdom to say, how am I going to spend my time in doing that? Uh, one Christian may decide this is worth my effort here uh, for my kids' sake or for my family's sake or for my church's sake. And another believer may say, you know what? I think we're too far gone. And I think we can be uh, gracious towards one another and how we respond. But no, it's not by definition hypocritical if you decide to get involved in some of these issues. That's my opinion. I hope you enjoyed uh, this video. And if you do, I hope you press the like button and then press the subscribe button uh, to get more videos by Grace Evangelical Society. And remember, keep grace in focus.